How can an attorney help me with my DWI? An experienced lawyer can listen to the facts of your case and uh, flush out what the various issues could potentially be, what your, what your defenses are, and then give you, provide you advice about how to proceed in handling the matter. Now, it's every single case, that's, it's every time a person is charged with any sort of criminal offense, is it the best thing for them to do is go to trial? And the answer to that is usually not. But the way I usually always explain it to my clients is, is they're the captain of the ship. This is their problem. It's their case. And a good lawyer is a good navigator, provides them with all the sort of different angles that they have, gives them a, a comprehensive understanding of what the law is, and then explores with them their various options. What, what, what's in their best interest, the choice that they should make, give them, give, uh, giving them a variety of different choices so they can choose um, the best option for them. And I think that's what a good attorney does um, with any sort of criminal case. Now, in a DWI case, the law is, 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 is a lot different than a lot of different um, criminal statutes. It's a different sentencing structure. It has effects outside the criminal justice system in your, with your driver's license. North Carolina, Charlotte specifically, is a, uh, it, it's not like New York City, it's not like a large city where we have mass transit, where we have a large urban population all living within walking distance of their workplace. So the effects that a driving while impaired charge can have on your driver's license kind of changes things. There's, a, there's an aspect of a DWI case that deals with the Division of Motor Vehicles. So, a, a lawyer that handles driving while impaired cases should be able to navigate their client through two systems. The, the, the system that deals with their driver's license at the Department of Motor Vehicles as well as the criminal justice system.